Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So, um, today we got a pretty cool one. We got another package from G1. Um, as you guys know, they are channel sponsor of ours for a long time now. Um, and yeah, um, make sure to check them out down below. Uh, I'm going to leave my link um, and my code. They Those are free. You get 10% off your entire order. And yeah, they got a lot of pretty cool stuff on there. Um, a lot of different spinners, fidgets, mechanical, magnetic every different kinds of uh figures so yeah check them out down below and yeah um let's get right into this thing so yeah huge 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 um shout out to them for sending some stuff over to check out i am running a bit low on videos to check out i mean videos to record <laughs> i gotta get creative and think of some ideas but yeah uh let's get right into it there we go i don't remember what's supposed to be in here to be honest they told me but i kind of forgot all right i'll just do this first i guess all right whatever this is all right let's get into it Oh, I know. This, this is a mechanical slider. Uh, Candy Cat Limbo. Nice packaging, actually. How do I open this? What the? This is a unique packaging. I've never had. <laughs> that works, I guess. Oh, damn. That's... Very unique packaging. Wow. Alright, I'm gonna throw this out. I've, this is by far the most fun unboxing experience I've ever had. Alright, so they gotta. Okay, I can't get this out right now. They got a polishing sponge, I believe. Alright. Stickers, wow, okay. A lot of accessories, extra springs, balls, and just a whole bunch of like confetti. Hold on. Yeah, all right, I'm gonna put these back. Love, love the unboxing experience on this thing already. They're doing it different, <laughs> but all right, let's see. Like, and again, make sure to check out G1 down below. I'm going to leave a link for this product at the top of the description. You can use my code. They will do the free You get 10% of your entire order. And yeah, let's see. All right. So right off the bat, I like the size of this thing. Let me get my scale in my... Six grams. This is definitely stainless steel. Forget that about that. Candy cat. It's a cat themed, I guess, slider. 54.7 millimeters length. The width is 20.8 or 21, I guess. And then the height on the highest, the tallest section is 13.7. All right, let's go ahead and hear the clicks on this thing. Wow. Wow, okay, this is a, an instant hit. Alright, 
one sec. I want to get my uh, I can't find it. I think I left in the car. But I wanted to get my Pop 2.0 because this is a very similar sounding click to this thing. Guys, I am loving this. Let me go ahead and get the sound of these clicks for those of you that are wondering. Um, all right. about this distance. It doesn't even go above 60. If I go like fast like this, yeah, um, I definitely, definitely got to play around with this thing and tune it. If I can get this thing a little stiffer, oh my god, this could be amazing. But out of box, this thing is extremely smooth. It's like a, a bing bing ping 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 kind of no noise. I'm loving that. It's a, it's a dense um, track, which I love. I have something else to compare this thing to. Here it is. I'm going to do a full breakdown video later. But this is the Mott Groove. Definitely quieter and a lot like smoother because of the dense track, but I recently did tune this thing, so yeah, um, it's good. It's very um, stiff and um, dense right now, the clicks. I mean, the, the tension in the clicks is very, very high. But um, I love this though. It's just nice, mindless. You can like... It's so smooth. It is not getting caught up at all. Um, that's because, um, what's it called? The stainless steel on stainless steel is very, very good. And it does not like, what's it called? It doesn't have a lot of friction, if you know what I mean. And it slides really, really nicely. That's why I always, if you're going to get like something sliding um, against, against each other, as much as like Zerk and Titanium sounds cool and all, um, and, I mean, it does look good, Zerk especially, but stainless steel and stainless steel is by far the best 
sliding plates that you can have so yeah definitely recommend you get stainless steel sliding plates if you're ever getting a fidget of any kind it would be the smoothest stainless steel and stainless steel so yeah uh, i'll be right back i'm trying to get my other fidget let's see if i can find it um had no luck trying to find it but yeah this is definitely one of the best mechanical sliding fidgets i've handled it's pretty affordable too it's stainless steel it it won't be much i'm not exactly sure how much it is and this plate right here when you hold it it gives you like feedback to it as well to your thumb Actually, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to carry this for the next couple of days, see what I like in this um, tension. And then I am going to go ahead and make a video where I take this thing apart and put it back together. And then as well, a video where I tune this thing and stuff like that. I have a video coming out for tuning the POP 2.0, so stay tuned for that. But this is, this is a great one too. Definitely recommend it. One of the best mechanical sliders I've got. So yeah, um, that'll be all for this video, guys. Um, again, thank you for watching. Again, make sure to check out G1 um, down below. I'm going to link this um, product link at the top of the description. Make sure to check them out. Um, and yeah, use my code. They get those videos. You get 10% off your entire order. And yeah, um, I will see you guys in the next one.